Well, hello there. Welcome back to my channel. This is Gina B. Living Fully, where I do Dollar Tree hauls every Sunday and other Dollar Tree content during the week when I have time, when I'm not working. I welcome you and hope that you enjoy this haul. So stick around. I've got some really neat things. And for those who have just subscribed, I'm so appreciative. Welcome to my micro mini channel. I am growing. I did make it to 700 and I think I'm almost at 720 now. So I'm very, very grateful for that. And I'm, I'm enjoying the slow growth. I, I am not um, trying to get, you know, a bunch of followers overnight. It's a hobby for me really I work really hard with people I do a medical based massage and I I really get exhausted and this is a, just like a wonderful way to unwind going to the Dollar Tree finding things for my uh, my little office and my home uh, makes me feel just relaxed so with that being said oh and those who have already subscribed and have stuck around and have been commenting and interacting with me I so greatly appreciate it and, um, you know, looking forward to growing with all of you. Uh, by the way, the channel name is Gina B. Living Foley. And um, I do have the bathroom Valentine's Day video coming right after this video. It should upload tonight. And I would be so appreciative if you would go check that out after you watch this haul. It features a lot of Dollar Tree items, so I invite you to do that. Let's get on with the haul. If you see this thing back here, that is the tail end of my belly dance sword. <laughs> it hangs on the wall, and I have used that thing over the years, and now it's just a work of art because I don't do venues where I work with the sword as much anymore. Um, but anyway, in the back is my precursor to a fairy garden. I am so excited for spring to hit and to be able to get in that garden and start putting up all of my cute Dollar Tree fairy garden items. And I want to share them with you. So let's get started. There are sometimes those days when you don't make it to the grocery store and you need an item you go oh god so we picked up a big mega roll it's called big mopper so we picked up a big mega roll look at that um the paper towels from here they break in half and I love that perforated break because a lot of times I'll forget my uh, face cradle covers uh, at work and all I need to do is pull one full size and slit it down the middle with my finger and I have an instant face cradle cover. It is so helpful when I forget that and so these are always at the office. Um, it's not my private office. I work with a bunch of incredibly skilled women at a wellness center. And so they love it that I bring these in. And so, yeah, you get, you get a lot. You get 168 two-ply sheets. So, I know. I didn't have to go to the grocery store. <laughs> Sometimes that happens. You go, oh gosh, I know we need those. And you know, it's 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 football day it's sunday it's football day and we're going to be making snacks and all of that too so i found another incredible find do you guys remember having you know the warm hot creamy tomato soup or the tomato rice soup with these delicious oyster soup crackers or some clam chowder or corn chowder or just potato chowder Oh my goodness, these are lovely. I'm making chicken soup today, and I don't put noodles in my chicken soup. Sometimes I'll put brown rice because the noodles get too mushy. Um, so for a carbohydrate, I love to put a little handful of these in my soup. You guys, this is huge. This is huge. 
Um, it's by Select Brand, um, Global Brands, Global Brand Select. I don't know this brand, but that's a lot of oyster crackers, and I'm so excited. The other thing that you can use these for, you whip them up in your blender real quick, and you add them to your panko crumbs. Um, if you're doing like a fried chicken or you're doing some sort of deep fried, this, this actually is a lovely product to work with. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. So I got those. Hold on. I'm going, I'm all over the place. My bags, I'm going to bring it up <laughs> so I'm not bending down. I've been doing that a lot lately and I apologize. Okay. So I also found, these are incredible. I absolutely love these. These are plastic watering sticks. So in my fairy garden, I'm going to put a couple of little potted plants and these will, these will be perfect. These will be perfect. Aren't those gorgeous? So like you fill them up and then you turn them upside down and you put them in your planter. So um, if you have succulents, I wouldn't recommend these, but these are beautiful, you guys. These are wonderful. The garden section is overflowing right now. Check your Dollar Tree and let me know in the comments below, what is your garden center getting? We've got all the hummingbird stuff, feeders and, and um, you know, the sugar mix. Uh, we're getting a lot of the containers to plant. But let me know in the comments below, what are you getting? And I just saw these today. They're called a garden plastic watering steak. And you do need to put it at an angle, it says. So there's directions on there. It shows you what to do. And it shows you the plant, you know, how it would look when you put that in at an angle. So, they're, no, they're not glass, but for $1.25, the glass ones up here where I live in the mountains at our garden center are about $25. So these were exactly the same color, and I just grabbed them because I just thought, my gosh, what a screaming deal. But yes, it, it, it is plastic. Um, I, I bought a back, a back up, or I may just put this on the other side of the garden, but I got another hummingbird feeder. It's the time of year, you guys. Now they'll feed all year long, but you guys, I have spent a fortune on glass ones and they are broken within three months. These little plastic ones last me all year long. And I can't tell you what a bargain these are. $1.25. Everything I have is a $1.25. Uh, I got the feeding juice too, but I, I know that that might be in the other bag. Okay, we have some real atmospheric weather headed our way. So that means a tremendous amount of rain. Excuse my little bangs. They're, they're in my eye. Otherwise, I wouldn't touch my face, but they were in my eye. Um, I got these six hour, um, oh, six four hour burning candles. These are wonderful little emergency candles. Um, I also use these, uh, we have a pagan holiday coming up and I don't consider myself a pagan, but uh, my family always honored the, some of those uh, rituals and seasons. And so in bulk is coming on the 2nd of February. It's a time for cleansing. That's all I'm gonna say about it. I'm not some, you know, expert on, well, I might be, but I'm not gonna share that because, because that just, that gets into whole other stuff. But uh, I grew up with a very eclectic, interesting Sicilian family. Um, and we were Catholic, but the women in that family did a lot of ritual work, a lot of um, celebrations of the seasons um, and the word ritual really is prayer work so these are excellent for that because they'll burn for a nice long period of time but we have atmospheric weather coming and uh, on occasion our power will go out and we have our generator but these are just wonderful to keep on hand you guys during the atmospheric weather stuff especially if you're getting winds you're gonna lose power 
These are good to keep in the emergency pantry. Really good. And screaming deal because at my grocery store, these are five bucks. Huge savings. Same exact brand, everything. Here I go. Here I come. <laughs> um, I also got another pack of these. You guys, these are always available at Dollar Tree. They sell the same size at my Walmart for $3.25. I would rather get them for $1.25. And it's exactly the same luminescence name brand um, at my Walmart anyway. So I'm going to save two bucks and go to Dollar Tree. Yes, yes, yes. If you need emergency candles, run to Dollar Tree. I'm just saying. We were out of, I have been enjoying a leave at such a bargain. You get six capsules. Don't take them every day, but you know, in my line of work, we get aches and pains because we are helping other get other people get rid of aches and pains, and we bend and we get up and we bend and we get up and we make the table and we're I mean stooping. We're it's a very physically demanding job doing that level of massage, um, and so Aleve has been my best friend when my low back is starting to give way. So I got those, and you get six to a pack, which to me is, is fine. I don't need a lot of that. My husband loves the ibuprofen there. They didn't have the liquid. You guys put a comment in the comments below. Do you ever find the liquid ibuprofen or liquid Advil at the Dollar Tree? Because we were getting it, and we haven't been getting it at all. So... Let me know if you're getting it. That gives me hope that they might come back. But we got these. These are great to keep when we go skiing. If there's a little ache pain, we can pop those on the way home. Um, so, yeah, we keep, ah, we keep those in the car. We do keep these in the car. These are wonderful to put in your emergency medicine cabinet or to keep at work. Um, I really scored here, you guys. This is called Hey Humans, and it was a wish list of mine. I know people have been hauling like shampoos and lotions. They had none of that. It was just one bottle of Hey Human naturally derived body wash that smells like lavender vanilla. Um, it's completely organic, hydrating, replenishing, jojoba, seed oil, essential oils, dermatologist tested for all skin types, um, sulfate, phthalate, paraben free, vegan, cruelty free. You just can't beat this. I know this is an expensive brand. I've seen this at my Whole Foods before. Um, it was a different item, but I have seen the Hey Humans at my health food store and Whole Foods. And it's a lot more. I can't quote the price. I can't remember, but it was not a dollar twenty-five, and that's a huge bottle. You get fourteen fluid ounces, and this is what it looks like. Take note. Take note. Yes. Um, look at your Dollar Tree for the Hey Humans products. They are out. Um, but I, I found one, that's all I found in mine. Now these are also naturally derived and they are sulfate and phthalate free, uh, body wash, gel, uh, aromatherapy signature, uh, ginger, citrus. That's it, this is a body wash you guys. We don't like keeping bars of soap in the shower. It becomes messy. So I thought these would be great. And I don't typically buy a lot of stuff from the Dollar Tree for my body or my hair unless it's completely paraben, phthalate, you know, all that free because of my alopecia. So, um... There's no name brand on here, but this is a beautiful bottle, and I, I've seen equivalents at my health food store. Just This is just plain gel body wash. You get 8.5 fluid ounces, and again, it's a ginger citrus blend. 
and I'm gonna go ahead and see I didn't do this in the store it smells very 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 nice this is very mellow I know it's not going to disrupt my pH so very nice so we have that one and then we have the um, this I know this is citrus lemon verbena it's lemon verbena let's see hold on oh boy that is heavenly oh boy look for this one lemon verbena body wash 8.5 fluid ounces look at how cute these little bottles are these look rich they look they have a beautiful look. If you're on a budget and you're trying to make your bathroom look nice, these are these are beautiful. And I mean, put those in a basket. I mean, that's just really nice looking. You know, it it it's it's nice. And these again, these are organic, um, paraben free, and so you know can't go wrong can't go wrong okay i scored something else in this you know cleansing family but not for personal cleansing i found more of these and um these are just amazing and i have not been finding these at all at my grocery store so we've been buying them at the dollar tree we didn't care about the price we, we don't care whether we're getting a screaming deal but you get six of these fresh scented Cascade Original Dishwasher. This is name brand, you guys. Look at that. Those little Cascade, the little, I mean, they have the stuff in it, you know what I mean? So that you don't get the spots. I can't remember what they, pods, thank you. Oh my God, finally, <laughs> finally, the Cascade Pods. And they're not carrying them at my grocery store. I don't know what is going on. So we've just been grabbing two or three of them at a time, which I would imagine if you get a big box of them, they're probably gonna be about the equivalent price. So not a huge savings, but to find the name brand at the Dollar Tree, you know? So we grab two, because we, we do the dishes, I wanna say three times a week in the dishwasher. The rest of the time we do them by hand because it's just the two of us and we don't dirty up a bunch of dishes. We reuse, ooh, did I hit something? Let's make sure we're not doing that. I don't wanna lose ya. <laughs> okay, this is so cute. I just, oh my gosh. It says, this is a cheesecloth towel. It says, I'm on my way to steal your heart and I thought that was so gorgeous. Now I'm gonna run this through the washer and dryer and that will loosen up that cheesecloth, but that's gonna be beautiful. You don't necessarily need to be in Valentine's Day to enjoy this little hand towel. This would make a great tea towel if you have lady friends over and your service, you know, you're servicing tea and you're doing things like that. This would look great in a picnic basket. Um, it's just darling. Um, I am tempted to put it as a hand towel in my bathroom, like over the top of my other hand towel, just for decor uh, through Valentine's Day. But that is a real cheesecloth towel. And things like this here at our novelty stores here in my tourist town of Placerville, these are expensive. They're like 14 bucks. So I am really thrilled to have found that. Let me know if you found these at Dollar Tree. Cheesecloth, beautiful little hand towels. Okay, so remember I was talking about the hummingbird stuff. So the hummingbird feed is back in. This is made in the USA. I love it. It's superior to my plain sugar mix that I was doing. These birds love this. It's not red, it's clear and they love it, and it's $1.25. They sell the same thing at my Home Depot. Maybe different packaging, but it's exactly the same thing for like $5. So I will buy this at Dollar Tree all day long. 
I'm going down. <laughs> going down to get this bag. Okay. My husband went crazy in the little food section finding little things for himself. He wanted his little Cheerios, his Honey Nut Cheerios, and they didn't have a big box, so he just grabbed a small one. He takes these skiing. So when he goes skiing, he takes things like this. He takes the little Dollar Tree snacks, his little soda pops, you know, because he's burning it all anyway. But yeah, they have these right now ready to go. So if you're on the job or you're on the go, this is brilliant. You add the milk, it's right in there. And that's why he brings it. Um, he also found, he loves to pop popcorn and then put it in Ziploc bag. This is a huge amount of popping popcorn, huge amount. And at my grocery store, popcorn is, oh my God, I want to say it's $5.99 all the way up to some places it was like eight bucks. I'm not joking. It's expensive up in here. It's very expensive. So we love our Dollar Tree for things like that. Uh, we also, he also found more of this stuff. You guys, I've been raving about this fresh success roasted potato mix. I use this in soups. I use this in stews. I, I definitely put it on my potatoes and roast them in the oven but I put it over all these other vegetables as well. Today, these are going to go, one of these is going into um, a, just a portion of it, a small portion. Um, I would say a little under a half of this package is going to go into some non-fat yogurt. And then I'm going to add these dried chopped chives I'm going to whip it up really good and add just one little teaspoon of uh, mayonnaise and I get a vegan mayonnaise so I'm going to put that in there stick it in the fridge and then serve it with some chips pita chips tonight when we watch the game so you know the, the, these are multi-use seasoning packs um, even though it says roasted potato, it's just the, the mix is great. I think it has a total of 200 milligrams, 280 milligrams of sodium. So I use small amounts at a time. I use it as just a regular seasoning. So sprinkles here, sprinkles there, but I am going to put, I am going to make a salty dip today. So yeah, I'll put in about, I want to say maybe just under half of the package whip it up and we'll have that dip for the week yeah with the chive but yeah i put i put this in soups it's so good um yeah they're getting a lot of spices in i don't know about you guys they're getting quite a few spices in um things that you don't normally find all right so for kitty stuff i'm repeating this my cat went nuts for this and these are natural um you can add this to their dry food, but it says it's made with um, natural ingredients, no sugar added, and um, no corn, wheat, or soy. Sorry, I don't have my glasses, but you guys, my cat loved these. You get three to a pack, and we give this as a little treat in the middle of the day so that he stays happy because he can't really go out in the cold right now in his he we have a dog run for him and um he loves to go out there and watch the birdies but yeah he's been cranky because it's been too cold and then my husband got him one little sheba you get two little packs of sheba you guys they sell these for more than a dollar 25 at the grocery store so I, I like to get that little pate for my kitty. Okay, amazing finds. I set, I saved the best for last because I, I went crazy. Um, I could have bought more, but I just bought, I just bought the one. So I bought one of each. Um, but before I show you that, we needed hangers. And I love these velvet covered hangers. Dollar Tree is great for organizing. 
and these are fantastic. These are the uh, home essentials or closet essentials and these are so much more money at my Walmart, Target, um, so I get them at the Dollar Tree. I also found a seven pack of the little plastic hangers. We were really running low on hangers, so yeah. Seven for a dollar twenty-five. Not the price I get at Walmart at all. Not at all. Um, I also got Power Oxygen Oxidol. I'm going to be adding that. I add just a tiny amount to my whites, my laundry. Um, yeah, Oxidol. This is Oxidol. This is a name brand. And it says, it's new. I've never seen this at Dollar Tree. Have you? Uh, I picked it up. I was excited about that. Um, okay, here it is. Oh my gosh. The wood cutouts at Dollar Tree are becoming better and better and better. And uh, of course, we're going into spring. So on our beautiful, handcrafted, beautiful crafted sheds by my husband, those are our garages um, living up here on the mountain. Um, we have a carport, but we don't have like a garage. So we have two gorgeous, gorgeous sheds. And look at this cutout. I can't wait to paint that and put that on my shed. Look at that sun. Do you see that? Look at that sun. That is just incredible. I will be painting that and putting a protective coating. And I just, that would be gorgeous on a front door, in a bedroom, anywhere, living room, whatever. That is gorgeous. So. Yeah, I can't wait to get that on my shed. I cannot wait. And then this for my husband's side. So I kind of have a shed, he has a shed. And this is incredible. This is a mountain view. This would be gorgeous on the front of a business door. I can't believe how gorgeous this is. Look at the mountain view cut out. Look at that. Do you see the mountains and the big beautiful pine trees, the cedars, just incredible, just incredible. That painted is going to be absolutely gorgeous. It doesn't even need to be paint painted. It could be stained in various different wood stains to bring out the different features. Look at those features. This is not completely flat. Those are raised. Yeah, I say different stains and then put a clear coat. It'll be stunning, absolutely stunning. That was the find of the day. That is the find of the day. This is absolutely Crafter's Square Decor, okay? So I did find it in the Crafter's Square section. And you guys, all these things that we bought and there's other items my husband took in that I didn't want to haul. They're just his snack foods um, that I've repeated a million times. I think we only spent like 45 bucks. Yeah. $43.68. Yeah. I can't believe it. Screaming deals at Dollar Tree today, you guys. Thank you so much for going along the little haul with me. I found wonderful things. I sure hope you enjoyed this haul. Put a comment in the comments below. Let me know what you're finding in the garden section of your Dollar Tree. I want to know. I want to know what to look for. Um, also, keep an eye out. There is another video going up tonight. Uh, my Valentine's themed um, decorated bathroom, my little redo for the month of February is done and I can't wait to show you. So please um, look for that video, okay? And I'll see you all next week. Have a blessed Sunday. Go football 49ers. I know, don't kill me for saying it, but I am, I am after it. I can't wait to watch. And I don't know what you're doing on Sunday, but feel free to put a comment in the comments below and let me know what you're doing on this glorious day. 
Take care, and I'll see you next week with a new haul. Bye-bye.